everybody, so we're here today. We're gonna to be doing the unboxing and the full review of the new X-Putt RG. Uh, so we're gonna go through full unboxing from a brand new what you're gonna get whenever you get it shipped to you, uh, all the way to un unpackaging everything, getting it all set up over here, um, exploring all of the new features it's got inside, and as well as checking out the new mobile feature that it's got. Um, so let's get into it. So of course we get our nice bright green X-Putt box here. All right, let's see what we got in here. Boom. All right, first thing we got, of course we got our user's manual and our stickers. Very important if we wanna get all the data in here. All right. First thing I'm seeing, we got our cables. So this is gonna be our HDMI and our, HDMI and our power cable. Let's get those out of there. So HDMI and power, power block. And then this is gonna be one of the mounts that you can hook it up to your wall, TV, what have you. All right, next up, we have the actual camera. So this is what gets hooked up to the tripod. This is what's gonna track everything. Just pop it right out of there. Nice new stuff on the back there. This is our Wi-Fi chip here. Then, Let's get into the remote. All right. So first thing in here, we've got our Roxor remote, or X-Putt remote, sorry about that. Got your remote, got your batteries, simple as that. Then we have our extender for our tripod and our actual tripod. And that just screws right into the bottom of your camera. And last but not least, we have the putting mat. Get this out of here. All right. So this is one of the big parts of the X-Putt. This is how it really tracks most of the stuff that you're doing. You can see. We got our beautiful little carrying bag there. It just slides out of there very nice. And then that's our mat that'll roll all the way out. Beautiful. Just like that. And guys, that's the whole unboxing there. So we'll take a break for a second, get everything set up in here, and we'll be back to show you guys how this thing works. So first, we've got our profile menu. Whenever you get this, you'll be uh, prompted to create your own profile, or you can kind of log in as a guest. Uh, this will make it so you can have multiple people on this and not split the putting data. Um, so let's go into SIG1, that's our shop and door golf account. And we'll get to our main menu. Let this thing get set up real quick. It's got to resync each time. Man. I forget about this part every single time. Perfect. All right, we're all synced up now. It's okay. Of course, we shall play at our own risk. So guys, our new features here. Big new one, Wi-Fi. So now your x is gonna be able to be regularly updated. Along with that, you are also gonna be able to play online with other players. So not necessarily just somebody else in the same room, but people that are actually across the country that have an x as well. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, so let's start with Classic. So classic is what's going to be all the stuff that was originally in the first X putt. So when we go into here, you're going to have practice, play nine, and challenge. So challenge is going to be where essentially you're playing nine with another person. Uh, play nine is exactly what it looks like. Playing nine holes. We got seven different courses now we can play instead of four with more coming here soon. Um, so the first thing we'll hop to, we'll just go to practice real quick, do a quick little overview of that. 
So with most of these setups, these are all the options you're gonna have as far as um, customizing your, you know, your putting experience. So we've got the green speed, we've got what course we wanna play. So with practice, practice is a little bit simpler, you know, it's pretty much just a flat green, so not as many choices there, but we've got our minimum and maximum distance, we can change the slope, the slant, tracking, all that good stuff. So we'll hop in here real quick, make a little putt, and we'll move on to the next spot. All right, so our first one, 4.5 meters. Uh, you can change this to feet. Um, I have not gotten around to it yet, so we will be on meters today. Um, so we'll line up here real quick. Just hit a nice, nice little straight putt. It's gonna be about 12 feet. We'll see if we get it there. Little pull. Oh, so we can see our uh, impact angle there was left 1.1 degrees. That's what's gonna make me miss left. Of course, on the left side too, you can see my putter just yanking onto that left side. So this is gonna be great for people if you get a new putter, if putting's just not your strong suit, this is really gonna show you where, um, you know, where you're lacking or where you need to improve on. So let's get back to our other menu. And then of course afterwards it's going to show you these nice little layouts of all your shots from the different distances, kind of your average grouping. Uh, always a nice thing to look at. Uh, and like I said, we've got our play nine and challenge. We'll go ahead and hop into the play nine and get to a hole real quick. So we can change our players, change our uh, change the whiteout. I think this is where they're going to have some of the uh, some of the new greens whenever they add them in. So it's just a spot left in there. And we are kind of testing this before it's out. So there's still a few things that need to be, or need to come out still. Um, let's go to, well, we are in Texas, so let's head over to Southern Links. And we'll go ahead and start. And so this should take us to our first putt at the Southern Links course on the first hole. So all of these, all nine putts should be, or all nine holes should be different greens, different putts, all going to have different breaks. And it definitely, they definitely upped the graphics uh, from the previous one. I will say the original X putt, it was a little bit basic. Now I can see, I can see leaves on the trees. This, it really does look fantastic. So we've got 8.69 uh, meters. We've got 0.2 meters downhill. So, oh, that's uphill, 0.2 meters uphill. So we'll take a little run at this one. I might have overhit that. Yeah, just a little bit. So there we go, a little bit past the pin. We'll see if we can't make this one in. And it'll get us to the next hole. Oh my, that's rough. Don't wanna be like that on camera, guys. You should, I recommend putting better. All right, very sensitive this thing. <laughs> incredibly, incredibly accurate. So we get our scorecard that pops up. Now we're moving on to hole number two, but pretty simple there. Pretty much we're playing nine holes of golf, but you already made it to the green, which I find to be the hardest part. So let's get back to our main menu real quick. Go ahead and finish session. I'm gonna give you a little breakdown. And boom. All right, so we'll head back to our main menu. And what, so one of the cool new features we're gonna check out is the explore area. So with the previous versions of this, you were kind of locked into the putts that it had predetermined that you could take. Uh, what we're able to do here, we'll go ahead and keep all these settings. Uh, so what you're actually able to do here is really control every aspect of where the ball and the flag are gonna be. So not only will you have choices of what greens that you would like to do this on, um, so you can see here we've got nine, all nine greens from uh, the course we selected. I believe it was the southern one. So you can see all of our different undulations here. Uh, down here we got a massive uphill tier and then a, a lower tier down at the bottom. Uh, down here bottom right we've got a little turtle shell green. So let's go, let's do eight. That one looks pretty crazy. So once this loads up, you're gonna have control over your flag and the ball. So right now it's floating over the flag. So let's do, 
we'll make a putt that's got to get me all the way up on top of this hill. So we got our flag there and we'll move our ball all the way down here. All right, so we got like a 16 meter putt. We're looking at about a 45 footer. We select it and boom, there it is. So we got a little bit of left to right break and extreme uphill. That's almost a full meter uphill. So we're looking at about two to two and a half feet. So let's see, we're gonna have to really, we're gonna have to smack this one a little bit. Oh, pulled it. Well, I must say, I don't think that was too bad, everybody. Now we're left with a little knee knocker downhill. It's like a hair bit of right to left. Just gonna barely tap it. And look at that. And then what'll happen is it's gonna reset it and let me do it again. So you are able to at any point essentially go back and change where you would like to go on these. So I believe, oh, it's gotta have the ball there. So let's see, it's our menu button. So we hit our menu button, we go to new positioning and boom, we're back at it again. We can change our locations, practice a new putt. So that's, that's gonna be really cool, especially if you just get kind of bored hitting those one, you know, those putts in a straight line, it gets a little repetitive. So this kind of lets you mix it up after a couple putts, you know, you get it down, we can change it up. So let's go back to our main menu and we can check out our last new feature in the main menu. All right, so our last feature, we're not gonna get fully into it today, uh, but it is our multiplayer. So this is not for you and a friend that are here. This is for you and a friend that are across the country, across the world. So we go into here and what you'll see if it connects this time, you do have to have a half decent internet connection. So connecting to the server. So right now we've got five different people, six different people that are wanting to play a, play a match. So all four of these people are actually in the middle of a match right now. You can see where you can see up here, we've got our two on two with these guys. We got one out of two looking for another slot. Um, so essentially these people are just looking for somebody to play nine holes against. Um, very cool new feature. Uh, I'm really excited to see what they kind of turn this into. I can really see this being fun, them having, you know, weekly competitions, you know, see who's, uh, see who's the best across the world. I'm very excited to see where this goes. Um, but essentially, it's going to be the same type of way as if you were playing the, uh, uh, the practice holes with a friend. Same type of thing. You're going to hit, they're going to hit, whoever's farthest out is going to hit again, and then it's going to show it back up on the scorecard at the end. Um, but very cool new feature, definitely going to make you want to get your buddy one of these for Christmas so you guys can have some fun together. Um, but that's about it for the new, uh, for the new internal features of the X-Putt. Um, the next thing we'll get into is we'll go over the new mobile feature, which is going to be very cool. Uh, but besides that, guys, you know, the, the stuff that stayed the same is the stuff that we'd like to keep, which is the <laughs> incredible accuracy of the X-Putt. Um, you know, even compared to stuff like the, the GC quad TrackMan, and Unicores, this has given me what seems like even more precise numbers than what I get on some of those. Um, so, you know, really lets you dive into what your, you know, what your swing looks like, uh, and what you need to improve. So huge, huge benefit to people who are struggling with putting or even people that are good at putting and just want to get that work in, but don't have time to go out to the course every, you know, every couple days and actually get the work in on the green. Um, all right, guys, so we're going to click our XPUT app. And then all we're going to hit here is connect. Now, the only thing to remember is that your phone and the XPUT do have to be on the same Wi-Fi. So uh, typically, you are going to have to get the XPUT plugged in at least once to be able to get the Wi-Fi hooked up. Uh, but besides that, it's very easy. I think this maybe only takes about 10 to 15 seconds and then we should see our um, our putting green pop up. Boom. And there we go. So we're going to hit OK just like we did when we were up on the TV. And now you see we've got our full practice menu. So we've got our green speeds. We can pick which green we want to play, all this stuff. So let's see. Change up to waterfall. We'll keep everything else the same. You see all the stuff we've got here. Go ahead and hit start and boom, we are now back on our practice green. So I'll go ahead and hit a putt here. So I'm hitting this putt backwards. So 
You'll be surprised by the results. And boom, a little short there, but you can see just how convenient this is gonna be for a lot of people. Um, you know, pretty simple inside this application. There's not a whole lot else you get. So like I said, you don't really get the, uh, the explore or the multiplayer, but you can really get dialed in with this. You know, you, you can change all the settings inside here to make it, uh, you know, make the distance whatever you want, make the speeds whatever you want. Uh, really a big change for the X-Putt here. So yeah, guys, uh, definitely check it out. It's uh, gonna be, I believe it's going to be released here in January, beginning of next year. So whenever you guys see that, definitely, definitely go grab them as fast as you can. They're going to, uh, I expect nothing but these things getting better in the future. We're going to have more courses, more stuff to do. Um, and once again, just another great product. Thank you guys.